day has ended. I'm gonna find a place to stay. I think I'm going to this first landing state park. Um, the dog really needs to get out of the car. He's starting to get really protective and growl at people now, which is, you know, I mean, not like when he snapped at somebody the other day because he's very food aggressive. So yeah, he's really getting to be, uh, he's manning up. He's thinking he's all tough now, which is good because I've got a creeper following me around. And at first I thought he was a really nice guy, but now I'm thinking he's a creeper because I, at first I saw him like at the marina and then I saw him all over um, Hampton. And then I, when he pulled back in the marina, I said, are you following me? And he goes, no. And so I started talking to him and he's a diver and he was really nice. And he got my, um, I dropped my uh, inverter in the water and he, got it out of the water for me and like I went out to like he seemed really really normal nice guy well then this morning I'm in Colonial Heights which is an hour and a half away from Hampton where you know from the Virginia Beach area where he works and I saw that car again and he was just like standing there in the aisle just idling and then I, I'm pretty sure he saw me notice him. And then um, I'm on the freeway here and I saw him again. And I was like, I know that's him because his car's got this like stuff on top. Like, I mean, it might not be that same guy, but it's the same car that was following me yesterday. And when I said to him, are you following me? And then we, we talked and I go, yeah, I mean, you know, I didn't really know if you're following me, but you know. I said that and he goes, he go, I go, but that was you, right? And he was like, yeah. And I go, okay, that what a coincidence, you know, because it's a small world. But it's not small enough that he'd be in um, diving on boats in Colonial Heights, okay? That's just not going to happen. There's no, it's just not going to happen. So, sorry, I'm driving. So, that's kind of creepy. Anyway, enough of that. Know about my day. Well, the job is really great. I love the job. Um, but I brought way too much shit and not enough stuff I need. Like, I don't have any really any camping gear. You know, I mean, I do, but it's all in Oregon, so I don't really have it here. So, um, of course, you know, I wasn't going to borrow it from anybody. <laughs> I borrowed some stuff from Mike. Really good boy in the car and stuff, except for being a little bit snooty. 